this puzzle looks easy. All we have to do is get that piece into the rectangle with these other three pieces. Let's do it now. Uh, reminds me of Tetris. We put that piece there. And this goes here. Yeah, I think this puzzle is going to be easy because there's so much uh, space to put in so many pieces in so many different ways. Let's see. Let's go here. Then put this one here. This could even be a puzzle where there's multiple ways to solve the puzzle. Let's see if that goes there. Yep. And then, hmm. Well, that's not it, but you can see we're very close. Let's see if we put that against the edge there. Yep. And then this one can go, you know, it's a little short to go there. Put this one. Huh. Well, maybe this puzzle will be a little trickier than I thought, but that's okay. I'm sure we'll get it. Uh, usually I don't like to leave those extra squares when you don't need to. But here, ah, that's a little long. So close, but it'll go in this way. Now this one, hmm. Yeah, I'm wondering if this puzzle is somehow way harder than it looks. It looks like it would be easy with all this space. Now that seems like a good start where now we've got space in every direction here. I think this should be good. Let's see if we can put this piece this. It doesn't go there. Let's see that side. No. So I guess this piece, well, it needs to go there, but that is not going to let us put this one. All right, let's try. We'll put the this piece in first. Because this one can go up against the flat wall, it's got that big long side, and then put the T in next. Now this one, this is going to be the hardest one to fit in, just because this is five, this is one, I guess they all have five. Yeah. So if that goes there, no, the Z can't go. This is going to be so satisfying when we are done here. We put that there, and then this doesn't go anywhere. Huh. Alright, what if I put this in against that way? Then we'll get the T in there. Something go how about this go in there? No, that doesn't want to fit. But if that did, then no, even that wouldn't do it. Let's see, that goes there. I'll try putting the T. Now I tried that one already. That was the one that looked good. This. this this is tougher than I thought. I thought I'd be good at this because I played a lot of Tetris as a kid, but I see the Tetris is not helping right now. This it? No, that's not it. Okay, maybe instead of putting this one in first, we'll actually try putting in this piece in first because this is the one that's always it's always giving us trouble. So if we put it in with here, then we can push it up against that side. Now, well, there's a lot of different ways to put this one in. Will it go in this way? No. But this one, there's a couple different ways. So let's try to place this T first. So this T uh, cannot be placed anywhere. Wow, this is difficult. This is, this is really hard. I thought it was this easy kids puzzle. Look at that. Now we got the big piece and we got the extra difficult piece out of the way. Now, oh, look at this. Look at all that space. So this is, okay. Oh, yep. Nope, it's a little short. What about this way? Oh, come on. Does it go diagonal? How can this be wrong? It's I don't want to break this block up, because this block of three pieces, they go perfectly together, but, no. That, that does not do anything. What about a small change, like this here? So that's all 